Sean Diddy Combs taken off suicide watch as he awaits his trial in court. Sean Diddy Combs is no longer under suicide watch in prison, where the family visited him. Sean Diddy Combs is no longer under suicide watch and was recently visited by his family in prison, as reported by a source to People. Since his arrest, he has been held at Brooklyn's Metropolitan Detention Center and was put under a suicide watch following the standard procedure in such cases. The disgraced mogul was charged with sex trafficking and racketeering. Diddy's not under a suicide watch anymore. A source from law enforcement revealed to the media outlet that Diddy is no longer under suicide watch and was visited by family at the detention center before his first appearance in court in early October. One of Diddy's attorneys told the new outlet, he is focused and very strong. He is concentrating on his defense and preparing for his trial. Following his initial arrest, he was put under a suicide watch as a safety measure as the rapper was in shock and his state of mind was unpredictable. At the time, it was not confirmed if he was suicidal or for how long he would be under the watch. Earlier, sources also revealed to media outlets that Diddy was locked up in the same area of the facility as Sam Bankman Fried, the disgraced FTX founder. The said part of the detention center houses 16, 00 inmates and is reportedly known for being understaffed and dangerous, Diddy's indictment. Diddy's indictment accused him of forcing women to participate in freak-offs which were elaborate and produced sex performances, as described by the prosecutors and organized by the former. Combs pleaded not guilty to all the charges and his attorney announced that the rapper would not accept any plea deal. The indictment also stated that the Bad Boy Records owner used to force women and sex workers to participate in freak-offs using his influences such as ketamine, cocaine, and oxycodone to intimidate them to join in. These freak-offs were often recorded on camera without the participants' consent.